green hops. I'll run through green hops. You can see here 28,000 pounds of green hops for fresh hop beers were made uh, this year for hop union for brewers, basically down in the States because it takes too long to get across the border and they're stale by the time they get here. I'm just going to go on the record. I don't like fresh hops. Uh, and I don't like fresh hop beers. And the reason is very simple. Uh, when you have to use five to seven times as much to get the same flavor and aroma, and the time of shortage, it's not prudent to create those beers. Um, so green hops, here we go. Same thing, got to use too much. Water retention. One of the things I find interesting is this next slide. It costs a fortune to ship these things because they weigh so much, right? These numbers, I was talking to Mike at Hop Union, and he actually said these numbers are actually half. So if you wanted to double those numbers per, well, they're not actually 13-pound boxes anymore. They're a little bit more, right? Hops and Brew School. This is something that everybody in this room should attend. Uh, I had the privilege of going there and chatting this year uh, with the home brewers. Basically, it's a two days for home brewers and two days for professional brewers. Uh, it happens late August, early September. I think the first week of September this year, if I'm not mistaken. No, it was the second week of September. Uh, it's fantastic. You, uh, you basically do two days of lectures. Uh, the second day, the, half, the last half of it, you're going to the farms. You're seeing the, uh, the pelletizing, or not the pelletizing, but the, uh, when they bring the cones off the field, then you go and they smash them. You go to the, the kilning rooms. Uh, it's fantastic. You can see here open forums with people, uh, great people like Steve Dressler, who's a brewmaster for Sierra Nevada, who opens the, the floor. Anything you want to ask him, he will answer. You want to know the recipe for pale ale? He'll tell you. Great guy. And a highly, it's, it's 130 bucks. There's unlimited beer that you've never even seen or heard before. 